everyone in this class we will see traversing a string traversing a string can be done using two different ways one is directly the sequence given in the for loop otherwise we can also have the index numbers of a string let us see how this for loop works for i in st here i is the loop variable and st is the string sequence here for example i have taken st as blackboard when the for loop starts i becomes each character of the string here when the for loop runs for first time i will take b as its value when for loop runs for the second time it will take l similar way it will be traversing from the beginning to the end that is from left to right side when all the characters in the string get over automatically the for loop stops so in the loop block we will be writing the code to manipulate the string or whatever is required we can also use the while loop for this but we will have to use index numbers of the string here is the example code for you index is equal to 0 so this we initiate as every string start with its index number as 0 then we need a input for a string we will take the input from the user otherwise we can also directly initiate the variable with the string while index is lesser than length of string we know index is one lesser than the length of the string so when we are giving lesser than length of string automatically it stops at the end of the string character now we can write the needed code here for example i have written print statement to print the characters again it will be writing the first character here after that we need to increase the index numbers otherwise it will be staying like that for that purpose i write index plus equal to 1 it will be adding 1 to index number so that it keeps increasing it will work until the last character of the string now i will demonstrate sample programs using both of these i will take the user input for the string st is equal to input of giving the prompt enter a string now for i in st let me simply print i print of i let us save this and run so i am giving laptop here so you could see that it has printed in next next lines as print statement creates a new line after every output now let me modify this program to print the string but after each character a symbol and in the same line so i am adding here plus i want one symbol i just give here symbol as dollar symbol and then i need that in the same line so i will be giving n equal to empty string now let me check computer you could see that after every character there is a dollar symbol added to that now let me use the while loop we need a index for this i will give ind is equal to 0 and then while ind is lesser than len of st now to access the character of a string we need to refer index number with the string if i want to print each and every character i will give print of st of ind after this we will have to give the index number to increase so i will give int plus equal to 1 now let me run this i give book here so you got the output we can also use range of function in for loop i give for i in range this always starts from 0 until the last index of the string so we can initiate at 0 and then we can say len of st otherwise we can also give just len of st so it runs from 0 to the last index so now we in this case if i want to print i will be using st of i 
So, here i is the range from 0 to the last index. Here is the output. So, either you can use the len function with the range, otherwise we can directly give the sequence. Hope now it is very clear to you. Keep watching this channel, keep learning, keep sharing. Thank you.